Well, I'm delighted to visit North Carolina to pay tribute to one of the Tar Heel State's most distinguished residents, a lady who is very dear to Americans everywhere. Kate Smith is one of America's great singers of this or any other century. Her splendid voice alone has earned her a place in the history books, but it's also won her a place in our hearts because of the extra something that reaches out to the spirit as well as uh, to the ear of the listener. Kate always sang from her heart, and so we always listened with our hearts. It's been truly said that one of the most inspiring things that our GIs in World War II, Europe and the Pacific, and later in Korea and Vietnam ever heard was the voice of Kate Smith. And the same is true for all of us. But I think the citation for Kate's Medal of Freedom, the highest civilian honor that our nation can bestow, says it all. The voice of Kate Smith is known and loved by millions of Americans, young and old. Those simple but deeply moving words, God bless America, have taken on added meaning for all of us because of the way Kate Smith sang them. Thanks to her, they have become a cherished part of all our lives, an undying reminder of the beauty, the courage, and the heart of this great land of ours. In giving us a magnificent, selfless talent like Kate Smith, God has truly blessed America. So Kate, on behalf of a grateful nation, it's my privilege to present to you the Presidential Medal of Freedom, an honor that you have earned many times over through your singing, charitable work, love of country, and by being an inspiration to all of us. me now that I have to uh, depart and uh, do someplace else. But Kate, again, this has been a great tour for you to do this. God bless you. God bless you.